Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Dragonith Dragon Mounts. I think this is episode number eight, and we are going to start this off with a little naming of our green dragon here. I got this name suggestion, and I think it fits. It's good. I like it a lot, so we are going to... Did that work? Hello? Ah, there we go. Perfect. Alright, so now we got the green dragon IV. And uh, we're going to fly over here back to the new place. We are still taking a break from the Viking area a little bit. Um, but yeah, I got a lot of ideas today. Um, and we are actually going to be hatching a new dragon and I think we're gonna go with the fire dragon um, as you guys know I did red wool for the castle roof uh, design it's not just red but um, we have the red wool for the towers and stuff so I think it's gonna fit um, this is a very fantasy style feel to it so I think I want to keep that going with the um, with the dragon as well. I think the fire dragon is going to work out well for that. So, to do that, we need these two bad boys. And, oh, now I need my food. Gimme, give gimme. Give also, I'm not sure if you guys can't hear game sounds right now. If you can't, I'm really sorry. I'm having an issue with my with my game, and I can't hear it, but I'm pretty sure you can. So, anyways, yeah, if you can't, I'm sorry. I'll get it worked out for next episode and whatnot, but right now we got stuff to do. So, let's tear this bad boy out. So, um, at first I thought it didn't matter, um, like what, uh, what you would place the dragon egg in. Oh. <laughs> what? That just disappeared before my eyes. I mean, you got... Hold on. No, it's gone. It's, like, actually gone. Okay, you know what? This is one of those times... You guys saw it, okay? You literally saw it go away. We're gonna just cheat that bad boy back in. I mean, you saw that happen. It had to have been a glitch. I'm sorry if you think I'm just a cheaty piece of crap. I know, alright, it's not the best way, but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Alright, okay, <laughs> there it goes, alright, let's get that out of there, and let's just, yeah, I want to do that on camera so you guys know I'm not a cheater, okay, <laughs> yeah, so I don't know what that was, this this mod does have quite a few glitches, it has a lot of glitches with the, um, with the dragons just spawning out. Or, uh, like, despawning. Sorry, not just <laughs> spawning out. Yeah, they have a lot of issues with despawning, so that's probably something similar. Yeah, uh, but yeah, I used to think that you could just place this wherever, and that because of the element, it would just stay that way, but I don't think that's the case. So, oh, that's going to be an issue. Oh, man, I thought that would run. Oh, I did not foresee that. Okay, okay yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's going to be an issue. Okay, we're going to have to get another lava bucket. Be right back. Okay, sorry. Yeah, that would have been an issue because I don't think it would actually put the effect of the fire dragon in there. But yeah, uh, I don't know if you guys remember, but I, I spawned or I, I did this and the dragon, uh, like I just placed it down and it turned into something different. I want this to turn out as a fire dragon, and I think the way you do it is with the lava. So. And it had to be like in a nine block or an eight block uh, surrounding thing. So here we go. <sighs> this bad boy will start to hatch and we have some stuff to do. So in the creative world, I'm building this in the creative world first because it's about a million times easier to do that. Also, if you build it in creative first and then you come over and you build it, you tend to just have a better look to it because you're not so worn out from going 
up and down and up and down and up and down. So we're going to jump over into the creative world real quick. And I'm not sure if I'm actually going to build this today in this world, but I, I want to show you the progress I've made over there. So let's hop over there real quick. Okay. So like I said, we made quite a bit of progress here. Um, try to ignore the ivy because I was just trying something and on a small scale, this could actually look really cool, but I think we're overdoing it here. So, uh, it's, <laughs> you'd have to put string all over the place. And I'm not sure that I want to do that because yeah, you have to put the string so it stops growing, but that's kind of a pain in the butt. And I think we're just going to not do it because I don't even have a, uh, a way to get ivy right now. And I did a ton of traveling and I never ran into the jungle. So I don't really want to do that either, but yeah. Um, try to ignore the one in the back, the tower, uh, because I'm not sure if I'm actually going to go with that, but just look at this bad boy. Um, yeah, just this little section right here is really what we're talking about. Um, so I'm not totally sure exactly how I'm going to do this. This is hundred percent going to stay the same, um, except for this tower, which is a four by, yeah, it's a, it's four blocks right here. This will turn into five. The reason I did it four is because this is an odd number or is an even number two. Everything's all out of whack on this uh, on this build right here. That's why the tower looks super weird. But once we get the actual build going, it'll look much better. Or it, it won't be much better. It'll just, uh, you know, it'll be even numbers, which will be great. So, yeah, but this is what we're working with. I, I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna keep it with just this side, but there's a chance I'll mirror it over here um, and just have it going out both ways. And I may keep this tower in the back. I'm not sold on it though, because this would be pretty annoying to have coming down right through here because it's obviously right at the front gate and that could be really weird, but I don't know. Maybe we'll have a tower like farther back. I just kind of stuck it where it was, you know? But yeah, so we made a lot of progress. Um, there's a chance I'll do this in the other world, but I'm not totally sure. This is a lot of work and I'm not sure if I have the time to do that. I'm pretty sure that we're just gonna have to um, work on some stuff other than this. But oh my gosh, look at this thing at night. Like it freaking glows, man. Like especially with this fantasy look this is so cool at night um just because it kind of adds to the fantasy it, this reminds me a lot of actually like like disney type stuff um i don't know it just has that look to it the very fantasy disney look going so anyways we're gonna hop back over i just wanted to show you this because we are making some progress i'm probably gonna end up doing this off camera in between next episode and this episode but there's a chance I'll get it done for this we'll see okay so I made a bit of a mistake here um, in the old yeah in the old um, Dragon Match mod the first one this is the second uh, the second one and in the old one you would surrounded by lava and that's how it would turn into a fire dragon but it turned into another forest dragon and I was confused. Turns out you have to have it above grass because it'll uh, turn it into that. And you also have to have it surrounded by fire. So glad that we got that worked out, but I'm down to drowning an egg because of it. I just broke the other one. I didn't like, it, they're not that hard to find is the thing. So I'm not overly worried about it, but a little annoying because we're down to dragon egg. But we will live. Um, I wanted to do a little work here. Uh, I decided to just go ahead and get this started. We might not even um, finish it right now. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and get going on it though because I have a couple things I wanted to talk to you guys about real quick. Um, <clears throat> or just one thing, just to run it by real quick before we jump back and start doing some more stuff. Um, so I just started a clothing line. I mentioned that in the last episode and yeah, I just started it, um, a couple weeks ago. Um, and I'm actually pretty close to being sold out on all of it. Um, but that being said, there is still some stuff left, left. And if you guys, um, are interested, I'm going to leave the link in the bio, um, 
I don't want this to be like an ad or anything, but um, I know personally that I bought things from um, from YouTubers, so I figured I would let you guys know um, because you may be interested. So I will put the link to my website on uh, in the description, and you guys can check that out. If you don't want anything, do not feel or yeah, like don't feel obligated at all to get anything. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, don't feel obligated at all. Uh, I really don't want anybody to feel like they uh, should be getting anything. Just letting you know in case you guys are interested. So, I'm going to get more work done here. Um, and I might finish it. I don't really know. But either way, we'll be back. Okay, I just <laughs> I just climbed up here to check on this progress. Like, literally right after I turned the recording off. And he... Is all grown up. Oh, I can't push him off. Oh, uh, I'll just. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Hello. Dude, you are floating. Hello, sir. <laughs> Welcome to the world. What happens if I push him off? Oh, dude, they take fall damage? I just kind of figured he would fly. I guess not. Okay, we need to go to sleep okay so he's all grown <clears throat> and uh, I've, I've given it some thought and for those of you who are still around from the good old days you know that I named this uh, my red dragon the first dragon of the entire series I named a beastie and I think I'm just gonna name this guy beastie throw back to the good old days you know dude you are small tiny little guy yeah so I think I'm gonna name him beastie whenever he's all grown up and we can do that this episode. I just wanted to show you the little hatchling. Um, he's probably going to be scurrying all around. I got to keep an eye on him until he grows all the way up so that I can tame him. And then we will do a little bit of riding. Okay, guys. Whoa. Dude, don't fly away on me. Is he just going to... Bro. Get over here. I got some fish for you, dog. Come here. <laughs> Bro! Come on now. Alright, let's just go over here. Land. Land! Okay, well... <laughs> what is he doing, man? He's like perching up on that thing. Alright. Oh, come on, you were so close, bro. Just freaking land! Oh, he's spazzing out so hard. Come here. Oh, I didn't grab a saddle. Dang it. Man, I give up. Holy crap. Come here. Oh, <laughs> dude, he is. There he goes. Okay. All right. No, no, no. Oh, my gosh. We are in for it now. Come back here, dog. All right, come here. Come here. Eat these. There we go. Okay. Got the hearts? Yes. Okay. Now come here. Follow me, homie. We gotta get you a, uh, a saddle. Okay, so. I went ahead and did this whole thing. Oh, we don't have a saddle over here. Wait, no. We do. What? Do not tell me he killed all my... Do not tell me he killed... Dude, no. Oh, I haven't been watching him this whole time. He totally could have killed them. Oh, my... You gotta be kidding me, man. Dude, it took me forever to get those guys in there. Oh, dude, at least I was like... Okay. I was doing a ton of resource gathering again. Um, including the Red Wolf, so at least we have a bunch. Oh my gosh, man. No way. Oh, might as well cook that up. Dude, that's so stupid. He freaking murdered him. Alright, come here. Freaking murderer. Get that on here. Uh, do you have any iron? Oh my gosh. I crafted an anvil. Dang it. I don't, I don't think we have any iron over here. No, we don't. 
let's just make sure. But yeah, I got all this built up. I wasn't planning on it. Oh, we do. Uh, but I don't remember the recipe. That's okay. But yeah, so I went ahead and built all this up. Um, that middle tower, I decided to leave it undone because um, I have an idea for this and I think it's going to be cool just to not do the middle tower. Maybe we'll put it farther back or something. But let's get a view up on our new dragon. Um, we're going to need a bone, which I don't have. Come here, sir. Thank you. You need to sit down. You are thumping all over the place. Oh boy. Dude, these look cool. These like, it, this has definitely been retextured. He looks super cool. Oh man, that looks awesome. Hey buddy. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Be Whoa. Oh, caps lock's on. Beastie. There we go. Perfect. And bam. Let's get off. Take a look. Did it work? Yeah, buddy. All right. Beastie. For those of you who don't know, that was what the old dragon, the, the old fire dragon was named in the series that I did before this. So that's why we went ahead and did it again. But yeah, we can take a look up here. Um, so there's not much that's different. The biggest difference is that that's ta that tower is five blocks wide instead of four, which isn't a huge deal. Um, this is also a little bit longer. They changed the roof up a little bit. Um, but yeah, I really like how it looks. It definitely is starting to come together. Um, like, oh man, that looks super cool. Get this out of here. Come on. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's definitely starting to look pretty cool. That is for sure. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy with it, and next time, I think what I want to do is right around here. Okay, so we got to bring this tower down. Uh, I just did the front facade from over here, uh, but I think what I want to do, let's get off for a second. I think I want to bring this tower down, uh, make it about a block wider all around um, after it gets to about here, bring it all the way down, and then I want to do like a little courtyard area. Um, but the courtyard would be kind of inside of this. I don't know uh, where, where the tower would come down and get real thick in some sh uh, in pillars that come down like right through here here There and there and just bring them all down and then do some like courtyard type deal around here <sighs> We're gonna have to see I'm not real sure I'm not sold on any of this, but I'm trying to get some ideas going um, We obviously have some work to do on the back um, it's taking some time to get there, but I don't really know what I do want to do here, so we're just going to do it as we go. Um, I think we're actually going to go ahead and call it. I know it's a shorter episode, and I'm really sorry for that, but I wanted to get this out to you because um, I know I've been slacking. So I, I, I should have mentioned this in the last episode, but the goal right now is that I'm going to be posting one video a week. So I know that's not a ton. But at least it will be consistent, it will give me time to make quality stuff, and uh, I just have a little bit too much going on right now to successfully pull off anything more than potentially maybe like two videos a week, but uh, but I'd rather be consistent and just do one a week and make it really quality. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, it's going to give me some time to really think up ideas and get cool stuff done, so I hope that's cool with you guys, but yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I apologize for this being a shorter episode, but hopefully you're happy with what we did here today with the castle and getting the new fire dragon. I have a really cool idea about uh, a spot for the dragons in this castle, but I got to work out a little more before we're going to be able to do that. So anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see all you beautiful, wonderful people in the next episode.